and then we're going to take this and roll it around. Hey fam, it's your girl Q from Cooking With Q, and today we are making an amazing treat for those who have been waiting for me to make something sweet. Yeah! We're making apple cinnamon donuts. They're going to be spectacular. They're going to be the most simplest recipe you can make. You can have donuts in like less than 20 minutes, okay? I got flour if you need to make them gluten-free, make them gluten-free. Um, sugar because it's a donut. Please don't inbox me talking about, is this a healthy recipe? That's sugar, okay? so. Sugar, sugar. It's a donut, y'all. The one thing about this donut that you will love is that it is baked and not fried. You can use applesauce, real apples. Um, this is apples that we just cooked down and made our own applesauce. We've got a little bit of kosher salt, baking powder, vanilla, cinnamon is missing. Where did cinnamon go? Cinnamon came back. She back. Hey, girl, hey. So, in real life, the first thing I want to do is, I've already sifted my flour. I want to put all of my dry ingredients in the bowl. So you got your flour, you got your sugar, you got your baking powder, and then we got cinnamon, because cinnamon was trying to be disrespectful and not show up for the party. The ghetto. And now I'm gonna mix all this together. My flour's gonna turn a little bit brown. You know, because cinnamon's gonna do her job. I don't know why she was trying to stay to herself. Ghetto. See that? It smells real good. And then the next thing we're going to do is I am going to um, get some soy milk. We have some um, applesauce, vanilla. We'll start putting that stuff in there. Come on out. We make some good homemade almond milk. So I'm going to use some of that. And we need a half a cup. So give me two seconds so I can get a measuring cup because surely I wasn't thinking. Ready, set, pew! And two tablespoons. You're gonna end up with a nice batter. Check it out, check it out. Nice batter, look at that, nice consistency. Let me tell you something, I'm really only about to make six maybe 12 donuts, but the reality is once I make these donuts, any leftover batter you can use for pancakes. Yeah! And I'm gonna give myself a tablespoon of like melted butter. Let's whisk her around. Oh, she's nice. Oh, she's nice. I'm gonna make this easy for us today. And you're gonna fill your um, donut pan almost halfway around. I love these pans because they're so, like they're easy and you can buy them at like Michael's or Joanne's Fabrics and there's always a coupon. <laughs> coupon, get it? Pun intended. All right, so I think it is time to put these lovely babies in the oven. Try not to get, like listen, if y'all donuts are looking like crazy, hit them against the thing so that they straighten out because you need them to be straightened out so they'll be pretty donuts. If they're not, they're gonna look like clump of lumps. So usually when you take these out, you let them cool for like five minutes, right guys? So I did the, you know, cheat thing to do and they have TV magic, so they already cooled. <laughs> Look at that, guys. Inside of this bowl is brown sugar, sugar, and cinnamon. And since cinnamon was trying to run away, I'm gonna give some extras. Mix it all together. This is melted vegan butter. It's gonna be like your dipping sauce. So I usually, the bottom of the uh, donut, I usually hold that part. Oh, I don't like dirty hands. And then we're going to take this and roll it around. So pretty, it's right. Hit that backside. Oh. So we're just gonna rub that around there. I mean, this is a cute donut. Look at that. Dip it in the butter and then give it a, a brown sugar bath. 
Now, the only reason I even make these guys is because when I found out I was allergic to all these different things, that meant I couldn't have the donuts at the apple orchard anymore. So imagine being somebody and you love the apple orchard just so you can go get those donuts, child. And you can't even have them no more. I was so mad. Mad is actually an understatement. I was pissed off. Okay, fam, you already know if you make this recipe, tag me in it. <laughs> Hashtag cooking with you on all things social. You know these donuts look spectacular. They smell amazing. And now you got other things to do with apples for fall besides just eat them. So, until next time, may your taste buds be forever satisfied. Bye. They got to come together right now. Don't overeat. Hey, family, if you like that video, which you should have, do me a solid. Click right here to go ahead and subscribe. Might as well. You're here. Just do it. But if you really love me, just watch the next one, too, because, honey, it's good, too. Okay? It's right here.